Hey guys, today we're going to take a look at a technology that has existed for a long time, but lately it has come to my attention as something very interesting that a lot of people don't know about, even though it has been used for at least the last 50, 60 years, if not more. It's called SSTV or slow scan TV. That means you can actually send and receive pictures and information via sound. And if you remember those old sounds from the fax machine, those are bits of information. And some of the pictures from the International Space Station have been sent via SSTV as well. So let's dive in. Let's try to send a picture. Let's try to listen what we can make out of it and see how it works entirely. And I'm going to use two apps here. One is called Robot36. And the other one is gonna is called SSTV Encoder. From the SSTV Encoder, I'm going to send a picture. As you see right here, Robo36 will be the one listening that will scan now the audio from this one. And let's go here and grab a picture. I'm just gonna grab my own logo here. And we'll try to send this one just via sound. You will hear the sound too. I'm gonna put the speaker of this uh, sender to the microphone of the receiver. And you'll see it in real time sending this picture from here to this other phone right here. And with that, let's begin. And while this is scanning, you can actually download Robot36, put it next to this sound bit that you're about to listen on this video, and you can have the same picture scanned to your phone just to test. So try it and let me know in the comments, how did it go? And let's hit play. And as you see, the picture was successfully sent only via sound. So it reads the sound bits per line and it, transferred it in the, transfers it in the other side. We can try another picture if you guys want to. And you can go with your own phones and scan exactly what I'm doing right here. It's actually a very beautiful technology that I don't know how to explain the excitement that there is to have the ability from a free app on your phone these apps are both free, by the way, that you can listen to strange sounds to most of us and convert them to, into information. If you uh, know in movies sometimes how they do the alien language and alien transmissions from space, well, they may not be that alien after all. And uh, let's scan the second picture and you guys prepare with your Robot 36, especially on Android, it works perfect. Put your... Robot 36 uh, app or the phone that contains that app next to your phone's uh, speaker that's playing this video right now and scan it yourself. We're going to do the second one and just have fun with it for a moment. Let's go ahead. And this is the uh, scan results that we just sent a picture via sound. That's all we did. This app here converts this picture into sound bits. And to me, this is a beautiful thing to do. You, people have been doing this with the ham radios or radio transmissions for years. This is not a new thing to them or to probably a lot of you watching this video as well. But to a lot of others, this is something that they never even heard before. And I believe this is a technology that you can actually use even daily if you want to. You can take a picture with your phone. Let's say you're far away 
and you don't have any other method of sending the picture. Well, let's say you take a picture on this phone, you take and you hit play after you put the picture on this app here, and you play this sound next to a ham radio or a walkie-talkie, and the other person on the other side that has a walkie-talkie, let's say you don't have internet, puts his walkie-talkie now to Robot36 here, and listens to the picture you're sending, and he gets that picture on his phone. Isn't that amazing that you can do with very low technology today? These apps are both free, and they both work, and you can just go ahead and have some fun with them. This is SSTV encoder that you see here on my left side, and in the other side is Robot36, and they're both found for free on the uh, Play Store, and I believe there is they are uh, available for uh, Apple App Store, but I'm not very sure about that since I don't have an Apple uh, iPhone to test it. And there's probably a lot of other apps that do this job this good or even better, probably. But that's what I had to try today for you, and uh, please let us know in the comments how did your results fare? How, how, did, how did your scanner work? Again, you scan with Robot36, and you put the pictures on SSTV encoder. And that's how you can communicate between the two devices. And with that said, we'll see you next time. Probably with a video with another transfer technique that a lot of people pro have forgotten already. Bye!